Takara Domi has announced the release of the Masterpiece Movie Optimus Prime figure, slated for a summer of 2017 release for a price tag of $99.99. This will rival their original release of the Master, uh, Optimus Prime figure released for their original Transformers movie. Here's to include additional paint, weapons, and metal parts. In very exciting news, Takara Tommy has announced the release of their Masterpiece Sun's Trigger figure, MP39. No release date or price tag has been announced, however some high-res scans of a Japanese hobby magazine show some of the figure's details, accessories, and articulation. It appears to include the chip figure in the wheelchair as well as some face masks and other accessories. There was also a release of an interview with the Masterpiece designer discussing that the line will now focus on articulation and a little less on the G1 aesthetic to try to match the robot and vehicle modes so closely. Uh, this is exciting news as fans will be getting very highly articulated, highly detailed Masterpiece figures. They also announced that they're going to continue to release the G1 cast of Autobot cars, uh, you know, the actual real car modes. And this is exciting news as well because we will finally be able to finish the Masterpiece line. Uh, there was also information about a hoist and trailbreaker release. Make Toys recently showed off a prototype of their Howling Meteor figure, their Starscream homage. This figure is slated for a July of 2017 release. No price tag has been announced yet. It does appear to be a fairly uh, accurate to the G1 cartoon. It's interesting that this release has come after the BB7 Toys and KBB Toy uh, releases. iGear, coming out of nowhere, has announced the release of Ironhide, Runamuck, and Runabout. These figures appear to be accurate to the G1 cartoon. Um, no release date or price tags have been announced, uh, but it is interesting that iGear is finally releasing new figures, full figures. New company Zeta Toys has announced the release of Takeoff, a Blast off for much. This figure is slated for June of 2017 release for a price tag of $59.95. Appears to be a fairly low price. We've also announced the release of World Blade, uh, another part of the Combaticons liner. Uh, these appear to be highly detailed and stylized. Uh, price tag seems to be fairly reasonable, so it should be interesting to see how the final combined mode looks. Just when you were thought we were done with KO Seeker Molds, BB7 Toys has announced the release of the green Starscream figure, the YM08. This is slated for a June of 2017 release for a price tag of $99.99. This appears to be the exact same mold, just repainted in green. BB7 Toys has announced the release of the Stubborn Buffet figure, their KO of the Make Toys Iron Mold figure. This is slated for August 2017 release. For price tag $69.95. Appears to go with their KO of the Make Toys couple of figures. Karatomi has announced the release of a Legends class Kickback, Brawn, and Trigger Happy. These appear to be the same molds as the Hasbro except with more paint and detail. I know some folks will be interested in getting these releases as the original Hasbro was kind of lackluster in the paint department. Uh, they also appear to include uh, headmasters that uh, didn't come with the original releases, additional headmasters uh, that they can fit inside the figure.